welcome to MLB The Show and this presentation of Minor League Baseball. A good one on tap for you this afternoon between the Arizona Diamondbacks and the Amarillo Sod Poodles. Jackson Goddard, a right-hander from the Sooner State, gets the starting assignment here. Dan, any thoughts? Well, Matt, this guy's one of those pitch-to-contact kind of guys. You're not going to see a bundle of strikeouts. Not an overpowering guy. Puts the ball on the in and outside corners, up and down in the strike zone. A pitch-to-contact guy, so if you're looking for strikeouts, you're probably not going to see a boatload from this guy in this one. That brings up Paven Smith. He will lead this one off today. Now here's the first offering. Hit in the air out to center field. Robinson is right there, one down. Batting second, the third baseman, Adrubal Cabrera. Digging in, the switch hitter, Adrubal Cabrera, as he'll dig into the left-handed batter's box. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. Sends that one out of play for strike one. Lots of kids here at the ballpark on their summer break. 94 degrees at first pitch. The wind up and the 0 1. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0 2. Pulled high in the air out to right field. Long run for the center fielder, but it's the right fielder that gets there to make the catch. And that's the second out of the inning. Third. Up the next for season. Arizona, Christian, Christian Walker. Walker. First pitch coming, here it is. Now that's popped up. Number one is there, and it's a very quick inning as the side is retired. So a relatively routine start for the top of the first here. So it's on to the bottom of inning number one, no score. Zach Gallen, a right-hander from the Garden State of New Jersey, gets the ball here. What do you have for us on him, Danny? Well, with a guy like him, you're just looking for quality innings. Usually he'll give you six or seven, and he keeps the team in the ball game. And when you think about it, what else do you really want from your starter? He's capable of shutting a team down and dominating, but that's not what's expected of him all the time. Lofted in the air out toward right center. There to haul it in is Escobar, and that's the first out. Batting second, the left fielder, Garvin. Carroll. Now one down with the bases empty and now we'll see Corbin Carroll dig in at the plate. Here's the first pitch. Now the second pitch of the inning is sent on the ground out to second. And that gets through for a one out base hit. That's what you want the guys at the top of the order to do. Set the table for the monsters three four five. Nice piece of hit. So now to the plate, Drew Ellis. Out in front there as this one's pulled off to the left side. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. Big swing and a miss at the fastball, and he's behind in the count 0 2. Carroll stands at first with one out. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Peralta's after it. He gets there, and that's the second out. Now at the plate, here is Dom Rolio. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. He's set. Here it comes. Hit out towards second. Right to him. 
throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as the side is retired. We've played an inning. No score here on the show. Second inning set to go. And coming forward, the veteran outfielder, David Peralta. David Peralta. First pitch of the A.B. on its way. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Carroll has it and it's a quick out number one. That is it. The catcher. Carson Kelly. And now in the box Carson Kelly. First delivery to him. Swung on and missed that time. It's 0 and 1. Hey, this offense better be prepared to pull a trigger. This starter is known to be aggressive and come right after you. Line hard into left. But pretty much right at the left fielder as he takes it in for the second out. Well, he hit that ball pretty well, but the only problem was that he pulled off it just a bit. The location was a little on the outer half, so he would have hit it even better if he would have stayed through the middle of the field with it. So here's Eduardo Escobar as he lines it hard to the right side, but out of play. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. This is pulled into right. Garrett is there and they breeze through this half inning as the side is retired. Diamondbacks down in order. We'll go to the bottom of the second. No score. And now Christian Robinson. Leading off the center fielder. Christian Robinson. Ready to deal. Here comes the first pitch. Hard hit towards center. Smith is there and he has it for the first down. Batting six. The right fielder. Stone Garrett. Next up, Stone Garrett. First pitch of the AB now. Swing and a liner. But this will hang up just enough as he takes it in in stride in left center for the second out. Batting seven. The first baseman. Andy. Yerzy. Now with the plate, Andy Yerzy will try to make something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. First pitch on the way. Pretty well hit. Deep down the line in right, but that's back into the seats. Foul. Swing line drive. That's going to be trouble. He takes the turn and heads for second. And now he'll get into scoring position with two away. Let's take another look at just a textbook that swing is. right there. Good the weight transfer, base. good Not hands the to the ball, solid contact, and great extension through the ball. Yeah, that's about as pretty as a swing gets. Nice look at it there from our camera guys as well. Into the box, Mark Lerma pulled toward right center field. And he gets there, makes the running play, and that ends the inning. So they can't make anything out of the two out double. Two complete, still scoreless here on the show. Ready now for the Diamondbacks, Nick Ahmed. He's the number seven hitter, but he's leading off the third after the first six guys in the lineup have been retired in order. Yeah, it's been a great start to the guy on the mound. It'll be interesting to see if they can find a way to get to this guy before he really settles in. Here's the pitch. Lifted in the air out to center field. Center fielder giving chase, and he tracks it down. Nice play for the first down. Batting it. The so field. now to the play, Josh Rojas. Josh. Rojas. Now 
Now here's the first offering. High in the air into shallow left center. Left fielder coming in. He gets there, and that's the second out. Jim LaCastro gets the call as a pinch hitter, and he'll get a chance with two Number out and the base is empty. First offering. Here's a looping fly ball out to right. Here comes the right fielder, and the Diamondbacks have their first hit of the game. Hey, just a nice piece of hitting right there. He's able to keep his hands now inside that, that ball, That's stay that. square as long as possible, and feed it into the opposite field for a base hit. Stepping in now, Haven Smith. Left side, but well foul. There are two gone, and the possible go-ahead run at first. Comes set. The 0-1. Now a ball lined hard toward deep right field. And that'll get down out there for extra bases. So now they'll have two men in scoring position following the two-out double. That was a great job of driving now that down. ball, extending his arms very well, was able to get it over the right fielder's head, one hopping it off the wall for an easy double. That's one of those solid hits that you don't even feel coming off the bat. Here now is his Drupal Cabrera. And a swing as he pulls this one into right. Garrett is there, and he puts this one away for the third out. So a great job there of working out a potential trouble. Diamondbacks strand a pair. Home half of the third coming up. No score. Alex Young enters to do the pitching, and best-case scenario for him is to push this one into extra innings. Jake McCarthy will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. McCarthy. First offering on its way. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Side, but it's well foul. The next 0 2. Now a ball lined towards center field, but right there to glove it is the shortstop for the first out. The batter, number three, shortstop. Camden. So the lineup flips over and Duzanac. digging in, Camden Duzanak. He flew out in his last AB. Wheels and deals, here's the first pitch. In the air to straightaway right. And this is hauled in just shy of the track out there for out number two. The bat. Two down, no, no one on here. base. And now we'll see Corbin Carroll dig in at the plate. He's ready. Here's the first pitch. This should end the inning as it's sent out to second. He's got it. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as the side is retired. So they go quietly here in this half inning. On now to the top of inning number four. And we are tied nothing-nothing. Matt Tabor, a six-foot, two-inch right-hander, jogs in to take over on the mound. Ball. 
All set for the start of the fourth. And next to bat will be the first baseman, Christian Walker. Christian Walker. From the stretch, grounded to short. Throw to first in time, one gone here in the fourth. Up next to the diamond. So one down, no one aboard. And up next, the outfielder, David Peralta. Ready to deliver. Here comes the first pitch. Softly hit out to short. And that'll be the second out. Now back. So the next to bat will be Carson Kelly. Hit it hard, but lined out in his first at bat. Yeah, pretty unlucky right there, Matty. Squared up a fastball nicely, and that's all you can do. You just want to be on time for the heater, and he's prepared for this next AB. Swing and a miss as he pulls the top hand over. It's 0 2. Hey, this is an amazing inning right here. Attacking the zone, keeping his defense invested. Chance to get off the field super quick. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Hey, you guys know me. Hitting's a process of elimination, and I'm eliminating the change up this next pitch. I'm on everything else. And that's a base hit. One for two in his first couple of plate appearances. Dan, he took that right back at his now face back. right there. Exactly the what you're trying to do. Middle cut, though. Are that's you a little ball. concerned? Yeah, that's a case of a ball being right down the middle. As a pitcher, you want to work the corners and stay out of that middle part of the zone, and he paid for it right there. And he whips on it as this ball's right under his glove. Now batting the shortstop, Nick Ahmed. At the plate, Nick Ahmed. He squares it up and hits a bolt to left center. That gets down, and the inning will continue. Now a long throw to third, and he is in there. And the run will score as the Diamondbacks take the early 1-0 lead. Hey, Dero, they're making this guy pay. That's three straight singles and a run driven in. Yeah, nothing hit extremely hard. Killing them softly, station to station with those knocks. In now, Josh Rojas pulls this one into the air out into right field. Right fielder is on the run. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. Only one in the inning for Arizona. So here is Drew Ellis comes Leading into this off. at bat 0 for the 1 in the ball game. Drew Ellis. First delivery to him. Down the left field line and deep. Hit hard up the middle. And the throw is not going to be in time as he's able to reach base safely. I got to be honest, I'm shocked he went back to this pitch again. The first one, he was on it and fouled it off. Second one, he did not miss. Standing in now, Don Marolio. As he'll swing at the first pitch and bang one into right center field. That's a base hit. Now this will rattle up against the wall. Not in time, and he's in there with a double. Finally, they show some signs of life. These guys have been Let's swinging the bats like they're underwater or something. But a single and a double, and now they've got runners on second and third. We'll see if they can cash them in. Into the box now, Christian Robinson. High in the air down the right field line. Right fielder giving chase. Makes the catch, but the runner from third breaks for home. And the run will score on the sacrifice fly as that'll square things at one to one. That was a good controlled swing out of him there, and that's exactly what he was hoping to do. Get it into the outfield and pick up the RBI. 
So next to hit is Stone Garrett. And he might very well get four wide ones here to try to set up a double play ball that could still get him out of here time. And that's the second out. Now with the plate is Andy Yerzy. A two out hit and win it. Pass ball or wild pitch would do the trick just as well. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Peralta is under it. He makes the catch and the winning run is left stranded. A run on two hits and they leave one. On to the top of inning number five we go. All tied at one and one. Dalton Varsho will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Number 12, Dalton Varsho. And now the first pitch. Grounded to the right. And that's going to be a base hit. So a great job off the bench, and he's aboard here to lead off the inning. Hey, that wasn't the prettiest of swings, guys, right there. That's not how you usually draw it up, but that's a line drive in the box score the next day. At the plate now, Haven Smith. And he puts it on the ground to second. He's right there, and he's safe. Digging in next as Dribble Cabrera 0 for 2 on the afternoon so far. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Now he spins on one here and drives it to deep right field. And goodbye. This one ain't coming back. So it's a three run shot to straightaway right field as it's now a four to one ball game. Well, with no outs, you can afford to give up a single, but you can't afford to give up a three-run homer. He just caught too much of the plate. Now he's back to the drawing board. No outs, and the inning is already an ugly one. So now to the plate, Christian Walker. As he'll go after the first pitch and promptly line one into left center field, and that's going to get down for a base hit. This will kick up against the wall now, and they'll keep it going here as he's in with a double. As we take a look at the replay here, you can see that it was a hanging changeup. Nice job of staying back on it, and he's able to tattoo it for a double. And you know, if that pitch would have supplied more velocity, it might have been out of here. He hit it right on the screws. Into the box, David Peralta, swing and a liner. And that's in there, base hit. Check out the lefty as he absolutely jumps on that first now pitch and hammers it to right. Got what he was looking for and put a good swing on it. Plate Carson Kelly. He swings and grounds it to short, and that's through into left to base hit. Throw comes in quickly here, and that'll prevent the runner at third from testing things here. I mean, there's no seeker right now. There's a fight at the bat rack. Everybody wants up at the plate right now. They're feeling frisky. They're all pulling the trigger early, and it's working. Eduardo Escobar standing in. Hard liner to center field. That's in there. Base hit. One run scores. And they won't push things here as they'll hold the second runner at third, so they're loaded now with still nobody out. Obvious pitch recognition right there. OO changeups usually get guys out in front, but he was able to stay back, recognize it, and drive it for a base hit. to the plate now Nick Ahmed as he'll reach for one and come up empty for the first strike he's one for two in this one fouled away Peralta at third Kelly on second Escobar at first with no outs this is line to left. 
Carroll is there. Let's see if they try it. And not in time as the run scores. The right boy. This one looked like it was headed for extra bases off the bat. Instead, a line drive bullet caught in the alley, but he does end up getting a sacrifice fly. In now, Josh Rojas as he swings and grounds it toward the hole to second for one, but he'll put this in his pocket and be content with just the one out. Now that the center field. The batter will be Dalton Varsho. And on the first pitch, he grounds foul. This, of course, his second appearance in the inning as they've now batted around. Gets the fastball by him here, and he's in control 0 and 2. Six runs, 11 hits, no errors so far for the Diamondbacks. Swing and a liner. Oh, and this nightmare inning continues as they're going to tack on even more here. Now batting the center field, Haven. Into the box Smith. now, Haven Smith, as he drives a liner to right center. And that's in there, base hit. And a good throw will wind up holding that runner at third, so the bases become loaded now, now with two gone. The third base. So now to the plate as Drubal Cabrera as he'll get caught chasing a bad one there at strike one. He's working on a one for three thus far. And boy was he ever fooled on that pitch. It's 0-2 now. Not a good at bat from him so far. He's got the bases loaded out there, but he's been way too aggressive, chasing the first two pitches way out of the zone. He should be sitting. Now here's a fly ball. Well hit. Racing back the right fielder. One run is scored. Man, he's been killing it all game long. Those two RBIs bring his total for the game to five, so he's been at his best when it matters most. No doubt making a bid for player of the game. Standing in now, Christian Walker. And it's grounded just foul down the line. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. He's ready. Here's the 0-1. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And nearly a three-run shot. Instead, it's a foul ball. Uh, that's a shame right there. Foul home run would have given his team the lead. Has to be able to. Throw won't get him. Now a good throw in will hold that second runner at third base. So they're at the corners now with two away. I'm not sure what else the manager or pitching coach need to see, Matt. He obviously doesn't have his best stuff. And the longer he stays out there, the bigger the hole he digs. Stepping in now, David Peralta. And it's fouled away. Singled last time up. Now the 0 1. Line to the right side. And a little self preservation down at first as he pulls that one in to end the inning. But not before they hang a nine spot on him here to really open up this ball game. Home half of the fifth coming up. Diamondbacks lead this one 10 to 1. Caleb Smith, a lefty standing now, six foot even, Arizona. takes over the pitching Number duties 31. here. Caleb Smith. Now into the box, Mark Lerma flied out go. in his first at bat, so make base him base. 0 for 1 Number so one. far. Here's the pitch. Swing and a flare hit toward right. And that's in there. Base hit. Somebody's going to be icing their thumbs after this game. That's a jam sandwich, but able to mix in a knock. Mm -hmm. 
Michael De La Cruz will come on to pinch it now with a runner at first and nobody out. De La Cruz. From the stretch, here's the pitch down the third baseline. And a flip to first from Cabrera in time for the first out. So now into the box is Camden Duzanek. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Hit to third. Taken there by Cabrera. And there are two away now. Next here is Corbin Carroll. He's working on a one for two game so far. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Now a swing and he pops him up. And this should do it. Ahmed is there to make the catch. And with that, the ball game is over. On paper, this had the makings of a real hard fought game. But uh, paper and reality, those are two different things. They pulled away and never looked back. How about to a tune of a nine run victory? 10 to 1, the final lopsided score in this ball game. Arizona put a 10 spot on the scoreboard in this one. Alex Young pitches well enough to get the W. Matt Tabor was absolutely hammered to the tune of 10 earned runs as he takes the loss. So that'll just about do it for us this afternoon. Thanks to Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak and the rest of the crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. To find out more, head over to theshow.com. The final line score for our ball game this afternoon for the victorious Diamondbacks 10 runs 15 hits no errors they left six men on base for the home team 